Auto follow-up for Gmail is the easiest way to make sure you get an email reply. Automating your email follow-ups allows you to schedule a series of emails that will be sent automatically until your recipient responds, stopping the sequence. Today I'm going to show you how to set up your very own email automation so that you can set it and forget it. First, I'll go to www.gmail-auto-follow-up.com and click on the Install button. That brings me to the Chrome store where I'll install the CloudHQ extension. Now I'll show you three ways you can set up your very own email automation for following up on your emails. The first way to set up an email follow-up is while composing your initial email. I can simply click here on the bottom of my email to select an email template sequence that I've already created called Meeting Request Follow-up. Just click Send, and if my email is not replied back to in two days, my auto follow-up email will go out, reminding my recipient to respond to my first email request. When I receive a reply, it'll stop my email automation flow. The second way to send a follow-up email automation is from emails that I've already sent. First, I'll navigate to my sent emails, select the emails I want to create a follow-up sequence for, and click my auto follow-up icon in the top menu bar. Then I'll simply select an email template sequence. In this case, it's a timesheet request follow-up. And in two days, if my email recipients haven't replied back to me, they'll get my follow-up email reminding them about my initial request, gently nudging them to reply until they do. Lastly, we'll set up an auto follow-up in the dashboard by clicking the Cloud HQ icon here and selecting Go to Dashboard. This opens up the Auto Follow-Up Dashboard, where I can start a new campaign by clicking here. Here, I can manually enter or upload an email contact list and compose my first email template in my sequence. I'll select an email template to set up an appointment confirmation email for my therapy patient. Now I'll scroll down to compose my second email, the Auto Follow-Up, here. This one will be an appointment reminder scheduled for two days after the first email. I can set up to 10 email sequences, but for this example, I'll stop at two. When I click send, my first email will go out to my recipient. And in two days, my patient will get their appointment reminder follow-up email. The sequence will always stop once I receive an email reply. Now that we've gone through the three ways to send an email follow-up automation, let's look at some of its advanced features. To stay organized, you'll now have two labels in your Gmail inbox that are automatically created for you. Auto follow-ups will store all of your active auto follow-up sequences and done where all of your completed email follow-ups will be stored. You can view any email with an auto follow-up setup where enhanced statistics are displayed for easy tracking. You can also click here to end the auto follow-up sequence at any time. You'll have the option to skip weekends so your automated follow-up messages are only sent during the week. You can also opt for a list of recipients who haven't replied to your emails yet. You can also add a BCC recipient to any phase of your follow-up sequence. Tip! This is great to include your own email address in your last email sequence to remind yourself that this person has never responded. Maybe it's a reasonable time to remove their email contact information from your email list. You can access and edit all of your personal follow-up emails by going to the dashboard and clicking the Auto Follow-up Templates tab. With Gmail Auto Follow-up, never miss an opportunity. Stay connected, stay proactive, and keep your business moving forward effortlessly. CloudHQ, helping your productivity one click at a time. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button if you want to know about all the latest apps that make you more productive at work.